everybody, Jay Nation Mobile here. I am here with another video, as always, and I wanted to show you guys this little method that I actually just, I'm not gonna say stumbled upon, but I just started actually paying attention to more, mostly for my videos, so that way I can get the best quality and um, without having to spend so much money. You know what I mean? So what I actually ended up coming out because I've been having, wanted to try to really show you guys my phone when I want to make displays on certain things or um, without having to put the phone in the actual camera. Uh, for example, this is my phone now. And it's kind of cracked. Like I dropped it a couple days ago. It was cracked all over. So I'm actually planning on getting another one. Um, even though you can see this phone when I place it in the camera, that's great. But I want you guys to actually see my phone. So I'm actually going to show you guys this app that I has been around for a while. But it's going to be a different way of using the app. Um, it's called MobiZen. A lot of you guys already know of it. You can use it to record your um, videos, just like I'm doing now. Or you can use it to, um, actually there's another one that you can, it's called MobiZen Mirroring, which you can use to actually show your phone. And you should record whatever you have on your, on your computer screen. So I'm going to jump right into it and show you guys how it, it all works. And then you guys can click the link to download it and try it out for yourself. It's free. So don't worry about actually having to pay for anything or signing up for any kind of membership other than the account itself. So I'm going to go ahead and just show you how I ended up getting it. Um, the first thing that will be in here will be this link right here, which will give you the information on how you can actually connect your phone to the service. The mobile, mobile is a mirroring service. It's an app, obviously. So you have to go and find the app in your phone, which is, of course, the mobile is a mirroring app. And it will look just like this. All right. Just like that right there and right there all right and of course I got both but um, I really only use the other one I don't really use the uh, the circular one it's only you want to click on the icon that looks like um, a phone and I usually don't use a circular one because I have another app for that um, that actually for me recording my my videos on my phone and that's actually called screen recorder but that's just for my phone so I have an Android but if you have an iPhone, it might be different for you. So um, you know, go ahead and try to find that app in your in your app store. Type in movies and mirroring, and it, it will be this right here. And obviously, I already got mine installed, so that's why it says open it or open, right? So now you can follow this instructions in here. First, you want to create an account, of course. Um, go to movies and the website. And of course, you go through the same process. Now, they give you the option to use a USB. I didn't want to do that. I have Wi Fi, so why not use it wirelessly? So, I ended up going to their website. I created the account through my phone, and then I went to their website here so that I can download it on my computer because you have to have it on both. So, um, I was able to do that. And let's see. Here it is right here. This is the actual app right here. And I put it on one of my folders. Right here, there it is. It's gonna look like this when you download it. And then of course you're gonna install it, all that type of stuff, and then you can actually be able to actually access it. So one line comes up, it looks like this once you get it actually downloaded, which is what this is looks like right here. So make sure that you create your account. If you don't have one, make sure you do so. Alright, now I'm gonna show you guys something else. Okay. So now that you have it downloaded on your phone and you have it downloaded on your on your computer, this is what you're gonna end up doing. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open up mine. So uh, you see me here. And I'm going to click open. Alright, so now it's opening, right? Now you see that. It's telling me to do this two step process and all that stuff. Now just be careful when you're watching this because it's going to go pretty quickly and you want to make sure that you catch every part. So I want you guys to see exactly what's going to happen. So now I created my account. I want to make sure that I leave this screen up. And leave this screen up right here and I selected wireless because you know everything is set up like it's supposed to go ahead and, and do that and then log into your account 
make sure you put your the right password because I had to right, type mine in a few times last time. So now you hit connect. Then you can see checking emails. And look at my phone. See it's still doing the text. Now it's connected. See that? And it also tells me here that I'm connected. Okay? Now I want you guys to see this. Go ahead and bring this up again. Go ahead. This, if you want to do the pro, the pro actually doesn't cost that much. It's the um, it's in the Google Play Store, so I'm probably gonna actually getting that eventually um, as well. Once I get my other phone, I'll do that. Um, so then go ahead and hit close because it's the basic. You can still use it. It's not an issue. So now, watch this. I get off of it. Now you see everything that's on my phone, and now you see what I'm putting on my screen. So now you can also be able to access the phone your screen and everything else. I can check out my Instagram. I'm going to go to my Instagram account, get my notifications, check that out. And the sad part about it is the phone that's on here is not cracked compared to this screen. So I can't be mad. You know what I mean? And but the only thing is you can't access obviously what's on this phone through the computer. So you actually have to do it through your actual phone to get in a better idea of all that stuff. So that in that so it, it, it it's it's a beautiful thing. I actually just watched this earlier. Yeah, I love dance videos by the way. Um obviously. So um yeah, you guys can definitely check that out. Let me know what you guys think. Um if this helps you out with your videos, you know, then perfect. You know, go ahead and use it for yourself as well. Um and also try a little see if it would work on my camera. It does work at the camera for the most part, but my camera has to do selfies, so you got that aspect. Um, so it looks like it's not doing it as much now, which I'm cool with. But at the end of the day, go ahead and definitely give it a try. Let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions for me, just leave some at the bottom. They go to selfie. And then um, give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. All right? You have a good day.